Hello everybody, Looney Farm Guy here with a new mod test for Wednesday, April the 27th. <clears throat> and this one, uh, well, what we have here is the Fint, uh, Fint 390 Vario S4. <clears throat> now, if you were lucky enough to, well, quick enough to download this as it popped up this morning, and then uh, you will already have it. Uh, for those of you who don't have this downloaded, unfortunately it is no longer on the Mod Hub. However, <clears throat> I have decided to still do a review on this because, well, some of you may have it. And <coughs> um, so, right, excuse me. Um, <clears throat> where do you find it if you have it? Well, it's a large tractor. Who knows, it might pop up again, so you never know. There it is, a, a 900 Vario S4. It's by Smitty. 20.72 uh, megabytes to download. I didn't check the... Uh, did not check the slot count. I will do that at the end. I have a couple of them working in the field. Now, uh, if we go back in there and get in, <clears throat> there are a number of options. We have wheel options. We'll start with Trailborg because Trailborg it does have quite a number of interesting. Well, it has the normal twins, then he has narrows, then in twin narrows. I do like the twin narrow option. Back to standard Michelin. Uh, Michelin's just your standard fare of tire choices. Same with Continental. Midas, your standard choices. BKT. Again, standard choices. Verdestein, nothing unusual there. Nokian, we have your two choices in Nokian. And back to Trelleborg, which has the twin narrows, which I do love so much. <clears throat> Design, now that's for the interior, I believe. You have power, profi, which adds some different type of mirror and interior stuff. Or Profi Plus, which adds a nice seat, I guess it's just, or just the regular. Uh, beacons. No, one or two. Engines. You start with the 305, go to 330, to 360, to 390. It's going to cost you 47500 for the 309 horsepower. Colors. Now, we have some interesting, so... Oh, <clears throat> interesting colors we're going to look at black so that the regular black is your black that you were all used to seeing that type of look if you see the reflection it looks just kind of matte but if we go to black 2 it becomes super shiny kind of neat i kind of like that uh so anyways uh, then design color so that is your grill chrome or black we can go back back to black and then a rim color we have a choice we can have white which is not actually white it's more of a gray there's the gray black you can have an all black vent except for the roof color it's funny that you don't have a choice for that or chrome very nice anyways yes so there's that <clears throat> now once you're in it so you can see the beacons, the lights, it's well lit, as they do, most of them are. Um, so L1 and right stick, left and right, uh, that, oh, there we go, that opens your back window, hooray. Up and down, opens your driver's door, so good. And your R1 and up and down, open up your sunroof, because... It is a very necessary thing. L1 and R1 with your right stick. Now this is an interesting feature. You can uh, adjust the suspension up and down. L1, R1 and your right stick right and left. So that could... <clears throat> it could be very useful. It may, may or may not be useful. But it's a neat option. All those other options are pretty much just oh driving direction yes there is the option to drive it backwards 
at 21 miles per hour only. Oh, 20. Um, in case you just wanted to do that for some reason. <clears throat> Your normal miles per hour forward is 39, which is excellent. Now, what other options do we have here? Of course, I don't have a description anymore because it's not on the mod hub anymore. Uh, a honk. A wimpy horn. Uh, what else? That's... I think that's it. Now, here we have him uh, working... Oh, they're both working in the field, and they're almost done this field here. Uh, this is the 390 horsepower pulling something like 450 or 475 which is very impressive and here's the 309 horsepower pulling a full what is he pulling i'll get him out of the way uh this is just the base the base one with with with, with uh, double tires of course <clears throat> uh 320 yeah so it's a little bit above not a whole lot above but no problem pulling that to nine miles per hour so they're quite strong uh, no doubt about that, and uh, the workers like them. So I'm not sure why I got pulled off the mod hub. Probably somebody claimed it was theirs, or some kind of whatever. Who knows? I don't know. I just load them up and review them and tell you what I think about them. So, uh, oh, interior, yes, interior, very nice, very nice. Um, and that's about it. I mean, it's another Fent 500. It's got some nice options. <clears throat> and it works uh, perfectly good. So if uh, that's what you like, and if that's what you got, uh, don't, uh, don't delete it. That's the uh, Fent Vario uh, 930 Vario S4 by Smitty, a 20.72 megabytes to download and oh yes slots uh, let's see slots not that you're really overly interested probably if you don't have it uh, but I mean it is what it is and it is 15 slots on console there you go I'm Looney Farm Guy and remember it's only a game till next time bye for now